Well, we're coming to the end of our first week back at training uh, for season 2014 and with the head physio of the club, Andrew Wallace. Andrew, uh, a lot of players back on the track after missing a fair chunk of last year. I guess one of the more encouraging is, is Daniel Markworth, who missed all of 2013 with an ACL injury. Where's he at in terms of his return? Yeah, Dan's uh, doing well. He's completed both the sessions to date, the, the running sessions. Um, he finished all of his rehab last year, so he's really ready to go. Yep. He's um, all on track. And some of the senior boys don't quite get back yet. It's only the first to four-year players yep. for now, but you've been in, in touch with a lot of the, the senior guys who have been in rehab? Yep, we've got, uh, got a few that have just touched base. Uh, Nick Rewald is over in the States still. Um, I spoke to him this morning, but he is due to run the day we get to Colorado. It's about 25th, 26th of uh, this month. Um, but he will, he's always on a modified program, being an older player. So he'll be back on track and uh, ready to go, no doubt. Um, a couple of the other boys, uh, Gwilty will run a bit late because of his knee, but um, he's doing all right. Sean Dempster's on track after a quick put knee uh, scope, as is uh, Reese Stanley, so they're all ready to go when we come back, which is good. So rewalt was a knee, just yep. a standard clean out that he tends yeah, to get every yeah. year? It was really good, he gets that sort of stuff all the time and um, bounces well, but we always give him about three months off running just because he's an older player and look after his knee a bit. Yeah. Sam Fisher was one whose season came to a bit of an early end. Where's he at in terms of his recovery? Yep, he's um, been running already for sort of probably four or five weeks now. Um, he'll have a review with the surgeon soon and uh, depending on that, he uh, probably will join in pretty much with the boys when they come back, which mm -hmm. is only a couple of weeks away. We've seen Aaron Sipos and Jack Nunes getting around the, the track fairly well. They seem to have made a pretty decent recovery. Yeah, we had three shoulders done. We had uh, those two and Tommy Lee as well. Um, so all three are on track. Um, I think with most of them, they start their weights at 12 to 16 weeks, so they're coming up to that now. And then um, they really don't start contact training and probably until four or five months. So we'll uh, see them on probably in the main group, I would suggest, at around Christmas time. Terry Malera broke his leg towards the end of the season. How's yeah. he coming along? Yeah, he's terrific, actually. He's uh, out there running. Um, you might send some footage of him running around, but he will probably do a month of agility and one-on-one -on -one skills, and then he'll be uh, back in with the main group, so he's, he's on track as well. Adam Snyder's had a, a bit of a frustrating past couple of years, uh, and he obviously missed a big chunk of 2013 as well. How's he shaping up for 2014? Yeah, Schneider's doing well. Um, just cut his thumb in the last game of the year, but um, he has had surgery and uh, his return to training date is actually the 18th, so when we come back, so he won't miss anything, which is great. So he's been able to run in the off season and uh, it really hasn't hampered him too much. And finally, another defender who had an early end of the season, Tom Simpkin. How's he coming along? Yeah, Tommy uh, compartment syndrome, but he's uh, he's come back well. He's actually out there. He's come back a bit early. He's uh, training uh, with our rehab coordinator at the moment, so he's just finished all that. Uh, he will definitely be on track. He starts with the boys on the 18th, but now he's in his sixth year, so um, it's a, bit, a couple of weeks extra off. All right. Thanks for the update, Andrew, and look forward to speaking to you again soon. No worries. Thanks.